Woohoo! We're back! How's it going, guys? That one took a lot longer to... Well, the reason for that is because I wanted to get that episode edited and have it on the same night as I did it. On top of that, I decided to watch Girls, you know, uh, outfit reveal. So that was important for me. On top of that, I decided to also take the time to watch the UFC 269. Holy crap, if you guys watch that, holy crap, just phenomenal, phenomenal stuff. If you followed UFC at all, seeing Nunez lose to Pena, Pena? Pena? I can't pronounce her last name. Unbelievable. I had wish I could have bet on that because it was like a one, every $100 you bet in, it was like 5,000 plus return. That's insane. I would have loved to have that. Anyway, I didn't notice that Mari's picking the basket was up here. Probably should have noticed that before I uh, walked off because now my save file is going to be... Oh boy. From 2333 to 30 hours. Oh, that's great. <laughs> but yeah, UFC, pretty good stuff. Gura's outfit, very cute. If not what I expected for, you know, a shark from Atlantis to be wearing. Hey, Mori, it looks like we reached the end of the road. Literally. It looks like there's a long bridge up ahead. Whatever you do, don't look down. Oh, joy. But yeah. I think we should continue on with this. We have, uh, oh, yeah, okay. I see where we're going now. If we're going, if that's the way to go, I want to check down here. Ooh, ooh, hello. It's the S key, I needed that key. Two keys left. Alright, so now we have the S key, we need to get the T in a bubbly tank and a W in the gut of a whale. I think I know what this gut of the whale thing means. <laughs> Unfortunately, I've been spoiled uh, thanks to Callie when she was playing. This. I watched a little bit of what she was playing before I wanted to like, I don't want to watch anymore and I want to know about this myself. So I know a little bit about what's to come up ahead, but that's about that's very little information. There's a hole here. Look in the hole. Yes. Ow. Okay. Please avoid my spikes at all costs. Thank you. The tentacles poking out of the ground, as usual. Anything back here? Nope. And then over here? Nope. How about over here at the abyss? This is the end of the highway. Yeah! So we're not going that way, then. Thanks for that, again. Oh, is there some here? Uh, I need to ask you something. Squizzards. Farmer Jim must be having a real tough time with those pesky squidges. Help him get rid of those empty creatures. Yeah. Okay, alright. So there's nothing there. Let's move on. You want to have a picnic with your friends? I do. I didn't even know that was a thing I could do. Oh, Mari's so cute. I can't believe we made it all the way to the end of the highway. But you did, and you should all be proud. The bridge at the top of this cliff leads to a place called Deeper Well. Word is that Deeper Well has been around for a long time, but the bridge wasn't there until recently. Who knows what's on the other side? Do you think that's where Basil is? We don't know for sure, but there's only one way to find out. Yeah, only one way to find out by physically checking it. Alright. Now that we had a picnic with our friends, let's go check this out. A clear bridge stretches across the trench. You want to cross it? Yeah. It actually looks really cool. And what's best, yeah, what's great is I'm not actually, like, Omori's not alone here. Because this is, like, something I would expect Omori to be alone at. That's it? It's just a pond? 
Wow, just look at this place. There's so many cool plants around. I bet Basil would have really liked it here. Basil. He would have really liked it. Right, guys? Yeah, I'm sure he would have. Huh? What is it? Hey, I have a serious question. Do any of you remember what Basil looks like? Why do you ask that, hero? Let's see here. Basil. Basil loves taking care of flowers and taking photos of his friends. He's warm, calm, and gentle. And even when he's upset, he always managed to he, he always manage to smile. The rest is starting to get a little fuzzy. Yeah, it's okay. Me too, hero. It's like I still miss him, but it's kind of hard to remember why. But that doesn't change anything, right? Even if our memories aren't as strong as they used to be, we still have to save him. Basil's our friend, and more importantly, he needs our help. You're right, Aubrey. I think we've all been apart from Basil for way too long. But I'm sure we'll find him, as long as we have Amori to keep us on track. All this time, Basil has been waiting for us. He could be lost, lonely, or scared. I bet he could use a big hug right now. Same. And we're all... Then, when we're all together again, we should all give him a big old hug. Oh, <laughs> It's nice to see you two getting along so well for a change. I could hug the both of you right now. <laughs> huh? Me and Kel? Could get along? What are you talking about, Hero? Stop being weird. <laughs> Relax, you two. I'm just playing around. Hold on, Basil. We're almost there. We'll all be together soon. Speaking of that, I was put in my pocket a bad drawing. Who or what is this supposed to be? Yeah, that's... <laughs> I mean... Okay, that's... I don't want to say it's close, but you kind of got in the ballpark. Oh, it's a teleport. Not what I was expecting. Can't go down there. Can only go up and forward. Hey. Well, can't talk to that. Hello. Your memories are not free. To gain a memory, one must another must be shrouded. And yet, all memories will eventually fade. Perhaps you've already noticed. The curse of deeper well. It's a curse? Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, I can swim. This is, I'm getting Kingdom Hearts vibe from that. Uh, the sun shined brighter when she was here. Well, who? Who was here? By the way, check out that background. That backdrop just... I mean, I wouldn't say I would like that backdrop, but that would be a nice backdrop. Right into swimming. Can we go a little faster? Mm, not really? No, not really. And by not really, I mean absolutely not. So, regarding the zone coming up, I know that the zone coming up is supposed to be a whale in the form of, uh, I think something named Humphrey? And that's about as far as I know. Then I also know Sweetheart goes talks to witches and the boss fight is the witches. But that's, I don't remember what the witches are, I don't remember anything about that. A long time has passed since you have ventured this far. Deep layers of this of his world open up as the dreamer grows more desperate. Even imagination is limited. Yeah? You have questions that I can answer. Answers that you have forgotten. I will lay them out for you. If you are curious, you will choose. My lost friend, the big yellow cat, white space. I'm curious about my lost friend, dude. 
You would like to know about, more about your lost friend. Yes. The friend you have lost is not in this world. What? The day he was removed, he was reborn elsewhere. What? He is special to you. A string of fate ties you two together. He cannot leave that place alone. To retrieve him, you will have to remove yourself as well, but in a way that is natural for this world. For headspace. The journey is nearing its end. You already know what you have to do, Dreamer. Is there anything else you would like to know about? Yeah, actually, since you failed, let me ask. Big yellow cat. <clears throat> you would like to know about the big yellow cat. I don't know what this big yellow cat is. Before this world was created, there existed three great creatures. The oldest, the wisest, and the favorite. The oldest is alive, but not the same as he once was. Age has removed his conscience, and he has evolved into a parasite within himself. He lives here, just beyond this cavern. The wisest, against her reason, committed an act that opposed the dreamer's will. It is an act that is not even known to me. As a result, she was stripped of her wisdom and banished to isolation. A special prison somewhere deep, deep down. The last in favorite, the big yellow cat, was chosen to watch over the dreamer's most precious room. He remains the dreamer's favorite even to this day, watching diligently, waiting for something to happen. The cat? That's a yellow cat? <coughs> Tell me about white space. Would you like to know more about white space? Yes. To be in to be in white space is to be nothing. White space is emptiness, a home without warmth, a place to survive but not to live. But e even still, your conscience cannot be erased. You will always find a way in. Even in white space, it will take the form. And if one wills it, something will be formed to subdue it. A hanging black light bulb. The repression of an idea. Yes. Perhaps it is time to admit that you are human, dreamer. You have listened well. I have granted you knowledge, but know that I can also grant you power here. This is a challenge that there is a challenge that will aid you greatly in this world. It is simple without thought, and if you succeed, I will be gone as well. I offer you this sacrifice. Will you take this opportunity? <sighs> no, actually I won't. I see you have chosen another path. However, my offer remains open. If you'd like to grow much stronger, speak to me again. No, I don't want to have the extra strength. I think I can do it with what I have now. I'm assuming that's not a good idea to take that strength. I, I will have to find that out later after I finish the game. <laughs> but I'm not going to take the, that strength. It's just not... I mean, I probably could steamroll everything if that's like what I think I'm assuming it is. Hmm. Man, we are really deep in the ocean now, aren't we? Alright, let's go. An unhallowed burden is placed an unhallowed burden has been placed upon you. You have the power to change the future. What will you do, Dreamer? What will you do? I don't know, because I don't know what the future holds for me at this point. Most I can do is just keep pushing forward and see what happens. Mash, I need you to have mood records. Ah, yeah, okay. So I know this this dude is the next area. After that, I am completely unsure. Well, hello there, friends. The name is Humphrey. What brings you here to my humble little cave? Oh, hello, Humphrey. We're just looking for someone. Sorry for bothering you. Oh, no, not at all, children. I do love visitors. In fact, you are the second group to visit me today. The first was just a girl, a very loud girl with a red, big red bow. Doesn't that sound like someone we know? Huh, is Sweetheart here? Where is she? Hmm, where is she? Where is she? It's on the tip of my tongue. <laughs> knack knack. That's a joke, it is. 
She is inside me, you see? She is inside you? Why, yes. She is visiting my guests, for I am also home to a family of sea witches. We spend our time together chatting and chuckling. It is so fun to hear about their daily antics. Sometimes they are even so kind as to bring me my meals. It's much easier for them, you see, for they are closer to my belly than I am. I. In fact, I'm sure they'd even love even more visitors. Here, let me lower the bridge for you. <laughs> my apologies. The first guest seems to be causing some indigestion. <laughs> Are we really going? I really don't like the idea of going inside a whale. <laughs> Alright. Go. Humor it. Humphrey! Whoa, Humphrey's belly is huge. Sure looks easy to get lost in here. I bet if I yell, I'd make an echo. Echo. I don't have XLR for to do that. <laughs> echo, 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 echo. Ah! Where'd you come from? Welcome to my lair. Are you surprised to see me? I am always here. I am inside me and all around you. I'm everywhere. Or I am just here. Wow, that's so cool, Humphrey. I wish I could do that. It's kind of gross if you ask me. It's kind of weird if you ask me. Wow. So rude. <laughs> huh. There are, there are many ways to go. Where should we even start? Left. Right. Up. Around. Does it matter? It's all forward, isn't it? Just pick one. It's easy. I mean, I was going to pick left. Actually, can I talk to, like, Humphrey? The, uh, Humphrey's whatever. Hi, I'm Humphrey. You're all access pass to Humphrey, aka Slime Girl's Lair. Strictly speaking, I guess I'm what you humans call an elevator. Unfortunately, we can only take one appointment at a time, so I'll have to wait your turn. Though, if you can find me a slime key card, I might be able to pull some strings for you. <laughs> Alright, anyway, I said I was going to start left, so we're starting left. This much I know. This much I'm well aware of, but I don't know the story of why we're in a damn whale. Oh boy. Uh, I'm getting... I'm having doubts about this area. Big, big doubts. Oh, hello, Marina. Are you here to steal my things again? Well, not this time. I prepared something extra special for today. Foo foo foo. As you know, I am a very busy person. But alas, you are my sister. I will grant you access to my room. If you are able to solve my little gift. I hope to see you soon, darling. If you're still alive, that is. Why would your sister kill your sister? Oh, it's a bomb. <laughs> Fun. Gee, you popped in just as I was in the middle of fixing up this tube. So, uh... Type, puzzle, theme, memorization. Difficulty, hard. You want to activate this puzzle. You cannot choose another puzzle until this is solved. I don't want to choose anything right now. Well, hello there, friends. Puzzles aren't everyone's forte. If you get stuck, I can help you a little. Out a little. Or maybe a lot. I'm preparing the interest of our exciting new attraction, but it's not ready yet. You should come back later. Tomorrow later. Oh, Mari's in here, of course. Now, Mori, I know what you're thinking. <laughs> you're thinking to yourself, Wow, sis, this is a weird place to set up a picnic. Well, let me tell you. It may be recommended to only set up picnics in normal places like in forests or campsites, but where's the fun in that? <laughs> what if I want to study the anatomy of a whale while I eat? Then what? Expand your mind, Mori. <laughs> I need to set an example for my sometimes boring little brother. My god, dude. <laughs> Some questionable gelatin, gimme. I don't think I needed to eat anything, but I wanted to. <coughs> Freaking. <laughs> you guys, we can't relax right now. We have a puzzle to solve. Aren't you guys afraid the bomb is going to explode? Not really. Just relax, Aubrey. We got this. This room's full of the smartest people I know. Hero. 
that doesn't make me feel better at all. <laughs> the lady on the screen she said she set up this up for her sister, right? She wouldn't really let it explode on her sister. I, I don't know about that. I don't know, Kel. <laughs> Aubrey's right. We're in unfamiliar territory. It's probably better to play it safe. What do you think we should do, Mari? Huh? Oh, I think you should do what your heart tells you. That is such a lame answer. <laughs> Thanks, Mari. I can always count on you. You're welcome. <laughs> God. Alright. Let's hit the save button. And, uh, I think I hit the save button like three times there. Amori! I wonder if that ever changes. I'm kinda curious about that. Alright, so I'm gonna start with blue. Type, puzzle, pattern. Pattern theme and easy difficulty. Let's go. Okay, that's not gonna tell me anything. Well, let's go and check what's down here. Ah. Kukra, lab work in progress. Disturbed sparingly. This one is Humphrey to Humphrey. Do you read me? Uh huh. Yep. Have you tried turning it off and on back? <laughs> Jesus. Shrapnels grow from tofu? Oh man. The cure for mortality? <laughs> Live feed on the workshop. Molly's always my serene man. Alright. So if I multiply the result, subtract by infinity, then divide by zero, and carry the one, that would bring me to an imaginary number. First off, you can't subtract. If you try to subtract anything by infinity, it's fucking infinity. And if you try to divide by zero, you get into quantum something. And the carrier one's not gonna help. Ah, of course, the calculations are so simple when you put it that way. No, it's not. There's nothing here. What am I looking for? Oh, there's more over here. Sweep, sweep, sweep. Can I talk to you? Greetings, visitors. Would you like to see something cool? This machine here can perform remote teleportation. With the power of modern tech, I can send this sprout mold to the other side of the grid. Take a look. What? An error? Someone must have messed with the program. <sighs> it was probably Molly again. She always pulls stunts like this. Oh! Wait, are there more? There are more! Alright, ready, gang. Let's do this just like your practice. This... this wasn't in my plans. Where'd everybody go? <laughs> okay, so we got... Sub I'm supposing that's working like a puzzle. Our... Sprout Mole 1, 2 there. Left, bottom. Hmm. Oof. Urgh. Hmm. Eh? Eh, what are you looking at me like that for? Can't you see I'm busy? Actually, I was just got an idea. On second thought, can one of you kids try running through those metal plates for me? I just want to test something. Why don't you discuss it amongst yourselves and vote? Who should help Humphrey with the experiment? 
hero. Leave this to me. Besides, I don't have a good feeling about this. Ow. 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 Eh, well, I figured... <laughs> Hero took way too much damage from that. Aha! I knew one of those spikes was broken. If I had a cup of coffee right now, I would sip it. Thanks for the voluntary risk in your life. Well, I guess now I gotta go fix it. So it's left, bottom, and right. Oh my god. Okay, this is the last one. Ah, hello visitors. After months upon months of hard work and toil, I've successfully created the first ever Humphrey Halloween machine. That delicious looked like the real thing. I couldn't be more proud. Hey, what's up, real Humphrey? Molly told me to stand here, but I don't know why. <laughs> no, get me out of this dialogue. Alright, so it's, uh, I'm guessing that's the pattern that I needed to work on. We'll see. You got this. Show the puzzle who's boss. Boop. 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 Nice. We finished one puzzle. <laughs> He's got a smile on it. A <laughs> Humphrey, rather. Memorization. Difficulty hard. You want to activate this puzzle? Yeah. I'm a big fan of puzzle games, so... Oh, fun. Alright. We got ourselves a red, blue, white, green wire. Where do we go from there? Hmm? Huh? <laughs> One, two, three snakes. Okay, wait, I'm in room two. Is that what it means? Oh, wait, 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 okay. So, room, snow. I just wanted to tag Aubrey. So we tag this one. Now we're in here, so this is room three. And then one. And you know what I just realized? I wasn't bloody paying attention to the colors in the back. Ah, finally, a room without a waterfall. The bright white light is perfect for my summer tan. <laughs> I should have looked. Why did I look? <laughs> God damn it. Alright, so we got blue. Then green. Blue green. Blue green red. Blue, green, red, white. Blue, green, red, white. Blue. Green. Red. And white. That wasn't so bad. Alright, what's the green puzzle? Multiple choice. Medium puzzle. Computer. I'll, I'll f Do you want to input a password? No, I don't. Oh, okay. 
entire fight? Fight? I'll fight, but I'm probably not gonna show it. Yeah, that fight wasn't really all that bad. Uh, I did get confused because it was blue, and I thought it meant sad, but it's not sad, it's just blue. You got mail mailbox? I'm sorry, a mailbox? Hold on. <laughs> Is that an item that I can equip? No? Can you smack people with a mailbox? <laughs> you can't smack people with a mailbox. It's only four extra attack, but you lose ten health. Is that really worth it? I think so, in this case. I think I want to keep the HP, but I really like the extra attack. Now to keep the HP just in case. All right, that's not HP. That's the HP. And I'm gonna switch to Kel or Hero because he's the only one who can talk to these stupid things. Hey, it's these guys again. Working magic, Hero. Ahem. <laughs> Greetings, Sir Conveyor Bot. My companions and I require your assistance in changing the directions of your conveyors. Will you and your friends please aid us? Hmm. <laughs> nice person. Get lost. Ah, <laughs> that's strange. That worked so well before. Don't be so down, Hero. He's probably just got his gears all mixed up or something. Could you say that to any louder? Now he's gonna get even more mad at us. Hey, Scrap Heap, you'll turn those belts around for us, won't you? Bzz, ah, hmm, rude person. <laughs> just like Molly. <laughs> oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Well, what do you know? It looks like I'm pretty good at this charm thing, too. Yo, you're not. Stupid game just tricks me. Uh. Your funeral, dude. Your funeral. Oh my god. You know what? I'm gonna show you guys that one because that was his funeral. Oh, learned Rally. I wonder if that's um, a damage boost. Kel becomes happy. Kel's friends recover and 50 co I can't use that. You're not a healer anyway. Even though you could be because you're really goddamn fast. Looks like a job for Aubrey. So... I almost want to look this up, but I'm not gonna. I picked up a V key. <coughs> oh no, it looks like it's gonna take time to get that, so it's probably gonna. Hmm. Well, oh, fight. I just realized those things are called worm bots. I mean, that's, that's something. Give me that. Homework? 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 Really? The bane of every child's existence. Where starts sad in battle? I don't want anyone to start sad in battle. Uh, that just sounds like a terrible idea. Boop. Okay, so... I'm confused. This is... Yeah, that's fine. Look, the camera's taking live footage of us. Say cheese. Aw, we look so cute. <laughs> Almost makes you wish we had a camera. Yeah, don't worry. We have loads of pictures of us, don't we? We have pictures of us? Where? What? Aubrey? But only when we least expect it. What are you talking about, Kel? Aubrey! 
Something special about everyone living in their own lives. Um, you're being kind of weird. Huh? Hmm. Ah, eh, never mind. Probably nothing. Let's keep moving forward. We gotta figure out the solution to these puzzles. The bomb could blow any second. Oh, that makes me really sad hearing that. Did Aubrey forget Basil entirely? What is it with every... I, I don't approve of this setup of you needing to slice a million traffic cones in order to get to this one thing, which is probably a trap. And I'm not going to touch it yet because I'm curious if it is something. Uh, can't go anywhere with that. So yeah, Cal, our hero, you're up again. All right. All right, so we're good. I still haven't found a damn thing about what I'm supposed to do with that puzzle. Um, I guess this is the other way we can go. Let's go. <laughs> There's a Humphrey up there punching something. <laughs> What the heck is going on? That's a bunny with candles on its head. It's a good thing I checked before writing this M, or else I've almost got almost written another B. That would have been pretty bad, huh? This must be one of Molly's crazy puzzles again. This girl love. <coughs> Excuse me. That girl loves to play games too much. Or she would just if she would just focus, she could probably do some good for this world. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to search places the one on your right. When I say you're right, I mean you as in the person standing in front of me, not some hypothetical observer watching us from behind the screen. Molly told us to write letters on her back and stand in this order, at least I think it was this order. Bomb. So the order is bomb, right? Wait. Pretty sure I'm supposed to play as the one on your right. So B O B O O. Boom! It's boom. <laughs> oh, that's a that's a good one. Okay, it's boom, not boob. <laughs> Okay, that was that was good. Got me again, you bastard. Boom. <laughs> Even though technically I really wanted to put boob. <laughs> Right, and that teleporter up there works. Nice. I am a little damaged. Well, damaged in the sense of juice. But let's just take a quick gelatin. Mm, gelatin. Uh, a quick save. Two. Should have just did this when I was down here, but whatever. Move away, move along up this teleporter. Let's go. How long is this going to take? I don't have all day. My work takes patience. Stop talking, darling. I need to concentrate. How about now? Almost done, darling. And finished. At last. My greatest invention is complete. Huh. Now speak. Speak, my beautiful robot. Well, I'm not gonna try and talk, say that, whatever that is. Oh, well, that doesn't sound right. Something must be off with the code. It's because you made to me rush my work. Instead of it, instead of to love, it must now be programmed to kill. 
Does it need to be? Does it? Hmm. Don't blame this on me. She's your robot. Thanks to you, my hopes of finding true love have been shattered. You've disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. My, what a handful. Well, she's not my problem now. <laughs> huh. Ah, oh, I almost forgot. That girl, she owes me my payment. I must catch her again before she leaves. Well, she's not here. <laughs> Alright, center it is. I imagine this place is going to take a little while. This looks like a job for Aubrey. Are you really going to start bonking Humphreys? Well, before you start bonking Humphreys... Man, I'm getting loaded up on Life Jam. I wish I didn't buy it. Kakra! Strange growth. We'll regenerate after being smashed. <laughs> Why is there always a sprout everywhere? Kakra! Intelligent growth. Will conveniently transform into a bridge after being smashed. in the language you cannot read. A telephone calls up the wazoo. Welcome. Marina is currently not seeing anyone right now. If you're enjoying the exhibit, feel free to crawl into a cage and wait for the next available experiment. You will know when the screaming stops. <laughs> no. Also, when I hear the name Marina, I think of Mischief Makers Marina. Good thing I can't actually climb in a cage, otherwise I'd be kind of pissed. I am Marina's first experiment. She made me out of sand and fruit when she was just a baby. What would you like to do? I would like to pet it. Fusha did a cartwheel. <laughs> Table covered in goo. A box filled with goo. Nothing special here then. Books filled with knowledge and language you cannot read. Yep. I am Marina's second experiment. She made me out of clay and rocks when she was just a baby. What would you like to do? I'd like to pet it. Hmm. Petting is cool, but I like handshakes better. <laughs> surprisingly tanking... Or uh, surprisingly tanky sprout mold thing? Oh my god. How many of these are you going to throw at me? Because this is actually, like, making me a little sad. <laughs> that you just keep throwing... You have made a mistake, man. Uh, oh my god. J just GG. I want to keep that one in, but Jesus Christ, do not make this team angry, because that my strategy is literally revolves around anger. Combo meal. Nice. Wait a minute. I don't know why I wanted to do that, and I didn't even know I could do that, but I appreciate that I could do that. You're faster than me. And you go down in like no time at all. Man, this is. I almost want to just keep these fights in just because of how ridiculously fast these are going. Tools for research. Yeah, research, quote unquote. I am Marina's third experiment. She made me out of rubber glove when she was just a toddler. Would you like? I would like to pet the rubber glove. Who did that? Show yourselves. Alright. Can I poke you? 
What? Who's there? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Ah, uh, how you doing? Why, well, hello, Aubrey. Look cute today. I don't need help right now, uh, Mari. I will, however, take a bite out of this jelly. And I will join this picnic. So I'm actually curious what the dialogue is now. Dang, what happened here? This place is a huge mess. Achoo! All the furniture looks really dusty. It's probably been here like this for a while. Ah, looks like it used to be an office or something. Wasn't this supposed to be a lair full of sea witches? None of this stuff looks witchy at all. I mean, we are basing this off Sweetheart's sources. I don't know if I would trust Sweetheart, much less her sources. <laughs> they gotta stop Sweetheart, she's definitely up to no good. Well, we do? I mean, you can always mind her own business. Oh, is that what we're doing now? Protecting the world from evil? How fun. What does protecting the world from evil have to do with Sweetheart? <laughs> have you met her? She is evil. <laughs> For a fair point. <laughs> well, I guess someone's gotta do it. <laughs> I'm glad you agree, Hero. Welcome to the club of agreeing. <laughs> uh, more fights. Yeah, this is the sprite I was confused about because... I swear to god, I cannot bloody tell if... Um, if these guys are sad. This one's not sad, so it's not taking juice damage, so it should die in a turn or two. Oh, especially when I have damage that high. Boom! Huh? Okay, well, see you later. Do I get XP for that? I do, unfortunately, but you blew up in my damn face. Pocket snacks. I've got a whole bunch of snacks for this occasion. I am Marina's fourth experiment. She made me out of dirty apples when she was just a child. I am sorry, my dude. I will pet you because that's kind of sad. Zzz, ooh. Yeah. <laughs> right behind the stem. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I am Marina's fifth experiment. She made me out of cardboard and candy when she was just a child. What would you like to do? I'd like to pet the candy. <laughs> Feels good to be acknowledged. <laughs> exactly. Alright. Open this up. Open this up. Open this up. I am Marina's sixth experiment. She made me out of balloons and magic when she was a teenager. What would you like to do? I'd like to pet the balloons. Later, man. I should have poked you instead. Plans for a failed experiment. Man, this place is loaded. Seventh? Okay, though the numbers do get muddy at this point. She would be out of birds when she was just a teenager. I'd like to pet you. This contributes to my abounding happiness. I have to go back. Oh, wait, no. There's something I could grab right here real quick before I do go back. Air horn. I love hair horns. Those are like my favorite item. I gotta buy more of those. Actually, do I even need to buy more of those? I don't even know. I do need to buy more air horns. God damn it. Can you even buy air horns? I don't think you can. Ah! Bonk! Blue. Wait a minute, can I go into the... No, I can't. There's a tree block in the way. Alright, keep going. I want to get through this area a little quicker than normal. What is... Is this supposed to be a Jacksepticeye reference? <sighs> I didn't want to show that fight because it was a teeth fight, but I did learn a new skill on Aubrey called Beatdown. Uh, 
Attacks a foe three times. Yeah, actually, I would like to use that. Uh, happy. Mm, this one helps with Mori. This one is great, for just in general. Headbutt is the one that's mood wreck. Fuck. <laughs> I have people who do three hits already. But to have another one would be incredible. So I'm going to have to drop Team Spirit, which means I need to change out a more skilled Lucky Slice. Foe's sad, attacks three times, foe's happy, foe's egg. I don't even have Lucky Slice anymore. I took that away. Hmm. I am Marina's eighth experiment, probably. She made me out of moss and bean sprouts, which is just a teenager. Pet. Yeah! Aww. Good dog? <laughs> oh, is that a knife? A dubious concoction, probably left untouched. God damn it. Oh, hey, that was Basil. Hey, look, it's a flower crown. Oh, no. All the flowers are bruised up. It it looks kind of familiar. I wonder who this belongs to. You think we should try to return it to them? It's Basil's, yo. This flower crown's in pretty bad condition. I don't think anyone will want something like that. Yeah, maybe you're right. What did you do that for? It's fine. You heard what Hero said. No one wants something as bruised up as that. But it used to belong to someone. Kicking it off a cliff is just mean. Huh? Why? Flowers grow back anyway, don't they? Alright, calm down, you two. Kel, apologies to Aubrey. Fine. Sorry, Aubrey. Apology not accepted. Hmm. That was Basil's. How could you do that, dude? Oh... Oh, I can take my anger on fights. It's kind of nice how I can take one enemy out in a single turn, but this is just dumb. Oh, it's a puzzle. I can see the puzzle happening right before my eyes. And a big cat head. Yo, know, this episode's already getting long, isn't it? Marina's 667th experiment. Caution to not poke the glass. <laughs> Should not have poked the glass. Hey, that's how you die. And I figured we were running away from it. string. I don't know what that does. Uh-oh. Oh god. Oh my god. Uh, I got the item. No. You. Why? Here is not the time to learn skills. Did I at least get the item? No. And I am low on health and everything, so that's unfortunate. Run away from the cat a third time. Get the item. Knock the things down a little faster, please. Yay, hero, you learned it. Oh, there's an item there, too. Get me out! Get me 
out. Oh, this is not good. Is the door locked? Oh. Oh. That's a big... That's a very high definition. Uh, you got a hot dog. Thanks. But I am still extremely hurt from that, unfortunately. And I'm not going to heal. <laughs> Ugh, this place is disgusting. What exactly is it that you do here? That's not your business, lady. Just sit back and relax. Ugh, feel nauseous. <laughs> uh, uh, oops. Well, that'll do, I guess. Alright, it's done. Here you go, lady. One perfect suitor coming right up. Say hello to your new soulmate. <laughs> hello. Is this some kind of joke? What do you take me for? I am ten times, no, a oh, hundred times more beautiful than this thing. You've disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. Hey, what the heck? You can't just storm off, lady. Where's my money? <laughs> Man, she's making a lot of enemies right now by not paying up. And, uh, I am very dying. But I accept that I am still not going to use my resources to heal. Instead, I'm just going to keep going forward, i.e. to the right, and hopefully Mari is up over here gonna save my butt. If not, we are very dead. Uh huh? I don't want to hit the bubble. Just gonna point that out there. Mari, where are you, Mari? Hey, check this out, humans. Did you know us Humphreys are strong enough to withstand a water force currents? Watch this. Hmm. Yikes. Except for that guy, I guess. Oh well, that's just natural selection working. Hey, you know what? I just had an idea. I bet if we gather enough Humphreys, then maybe we could use them to form a bridge to the other side. Hey, I was supposed to say that. Mari. Mari, you're here. Thank God. Give me some of that gelatin. Fill me up to max HP. It's important. Do you want to have picnic with friends? Yes. Mari, this gelatin is delicious. What's made? What's it made out of? I'm not sure, Cal. I've been scooping it off the walls and the floor. Oh, do you like it? You. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just kidding. I made it by mixing fruit and, um, gelatin. Okay, yeah, but what's gelatin made out of? Wow, Kel, gelatin? Gelatin is made out of gelatin. I see. Well, oh, whatever. Food is food, I guess. <laughs> hmm. Have I been missing all of these picnic things? Like, if I have been, I am very sad about that. Anyway, we're gonna end it off here. We will finish off Humphrey the Whale's area in the next episode. For now, I will catch you guys on the next one. If you liked what you saw, feel free to like, subscribe, you know all the jazz. Thank you. Bye-bye.